Just try it. Oh yeah. It's good. <laughs>I'm Doug with America's Best Restaurants. We're traveling the country from coast to coast to find restaurants that you should dine at on a weekly basis, like right here in Dayton, Ohio. We're actually just north of downtown Dayton at Dayton Village Pizza Turkish. Now we're not having pizza today. We're gonna show the other side of the menu and you are going to enjoy. You like big plates? Oh, trust me, we have big plates. So why don't you come with me Let's go inside and check out the menu. We are inside. This is going in. It's a family restaurant. She's like owner, operator, bookkeeper. Yes. You run the kitchen. She does everything. And we have a spread that I got to dig into. So going in, let's go first off item number one. What dish are we looking at? This is what we call the malama, made of a steak meat and a potato veggie. All right. It, it cooks about 45 minutes. It tastes real good. You cook everything real nicely, slowly, take time. Just try it. Oh yeah. It's good. <laughs> There's a lot of love on that plate. Yes. Actually, you eat this with the bread. You dip the bread in a sauce. Okay. You have a Turkish bread that we make that here. Okay. Oh, I gotta do this right. Okay. Dip it in the sauce. Yes. And you make the bread? Yes, we make the bread too. All the taste is in the sauce. <laughs> that was good. So, family restaurant. Are these like recipes passed down from generations? Are there some newer recipes? Like that one there. It's all like generation cultural, you know? Everything comes from the past, our countries, from everywhere. Mm. All right. Let me eat more bread. Okay, item number two. Uh, Man, this thing looks fantastic. What are we looking at? We call this as a mixed grill. It comes with steak shashlik, chicken shashlik, and adana kebab. Adana kebab is a lule that we call in our traditional language. It's lule because it's long. And we have a chobani salad, carrot salad, and mm. our cabbage, uh, how do they call that? Pickle? Pickle. Yes, cabbage right. pickle. And mm. our rice. Veggie rice. Mm. Seasoned with onions, vinegar. It wow. Good too. And as you said, the the dishes make take like 40, 45 minutes to make. Yes. This is this is not a slow process. Oh it's no, done. it's not slow, no. Everything takes time. Homemade. Homemade. Things back in the kitchen. Yeah. Like the tortilla and everything else. Yes. Wow. So Culinary background. Who who has the culinary background? Not me. <laughs> Not you? Not you? No. <laughs> but Fair. I just know how to cook since I was a little... And my mom, she used to go to the shop outside the state, I mean, outside the country. Uh -huh. You know, so I was staying home with my little brothers. So she teach me how to cook, you know, little by little. So I stay and I cook. So from that, it comes how I know how to cook. Nice. And then family, so who else is working back in the kitchen to help out? My dad, me, one of our workers, my mom comes to help when we are real busy. My brothers, we used to be like four cookers right. a lot. Yeah, we were like very busy. And now everybody has their own business, you know, trucking. Two of them went to, uh, back to trucking. One of them went to the back to own business. Okay. So I'm the one who stays here. <laughs> You and now full disclosure as we were in the back and watching all of this get prepared, she was running crazy. Phones ringing, you're cooking, yes. you got you have orders coming in, you're doing everything. You're a jack of all trades, give me a rock. Yeah, she's a rock star. Okay, so uh, let's go here. We call that samsa. We bake that here too. It's seasoned with the meat, onions, 
and salt and black pepper. We open the dough here. It's a buttery dough. Mm. And we cook that here too. You saw that too, how we make all this. Exactly. So, so what's in the middle? Meat, onions, salt, and black pepper. It's so good. It's not really spicy. It just has a nice blend of flavors. Yes. That's really the best way I can. That is good. And it's black cumin. Yes, black and white. We know that. Okay, lastly, what plate is this? That's a plow. Uh, we uh, eat, eat it with a uh, steak, steak ribeyes. Okay. That's what they call, I think, and garlic. We put that at the end for the decoration. And rice, veggies, all that cooks together, steams together, and becomes the rice. Now, these are big portions. Yeah. These are regular, normal yes. portions. Yes, that's a one-person per, one portion. This is a one-person. That's a one-person. You get your money's worth. <laughs> that's good. Ma'am. If you serve, you have to serve like this. Big you, person. You, I was, I was going to say, come hungry. Yes. Come hungry. Don't eat anything. <laughs> no, don't don't come going, man, I'm kind of hungry. No. Nah. Come hungry. This is this is fantastic. So you can finish all. Yes, you have to finish it all. These are just three, four of the items. You've got a full menu. So oh, the, yeah. So there's there's a whole lot more. If you're located just north of downtown Dayton, there's always things going on in Dayton. So if someone lives in the area or they're coming to visit, how can they find you? Online, social media? Everywhere they can find me. Google Maps, Snapchat, TikTok, uh, TikTok too. All your Instagram, TikTok. Instagram, Facebook. Yes, everywhere. All right. You can find us everywhere. Just hey. right, Dating Village Pizza. That's it. You can see us everywhere. You'll find them right here. There's also a full listing right here on americasbestrestaurants.com. Click the subscribe button, subscribe to the channel, and you'll get updates and you can find out more. So there's a lot of food. So we got to dig in. Austin's behind the camera. He's a growing boy, so he's going to have to eat as well. So I encourage you, if you're in the area, you need to come check this place out. You will not be disappointed and come hungry. That's all to I can enjoy tell you. it all. And enjoy it all and come watch this woman. She's amazing. The whole family's Running here. <laughs> Love it. Great Thank job. You. Great job. So come check them out. Until the next episode, I'm digging in. I'm out.